Today something terrible happened. A strange Digimon appeared in the middle of my bed. It was so cold in there. Even when I tried calling out for help, nobody came for me. But these two detectives eventually showed up. Kyoko and Ami. Ami asked me who I was. But, I said I didn't know. So Kyoko gave me a name. She decided to call me Pete, because I'm some sort of time capsule. Yep, Pete, that's my name. It made me so happy to have one. Names really are, are, names really are special things to have. Sits me on his cap and tells me all about her. Everything is perfect about her. Her singing, her dancing, her look, everything. He says she's one in a million among idols. I can't do. I can't do any of those things. I can sing. I can't dance, but what can I do is, what I can do is curl up and go asleep on your sister's lap. I love doing that. I also just love hearing your sister talk to me so happily. Knock down Broadway Construction Part 3. <coughs> With no blu blueprints to draw upon. Concrete was poured and rebar was erected, tailored to the land around the site. When construction was concluded four years later, the final building had three underground floors, as well as ten floors above ground. East Asia's greatest commercial building was therefore constructed on little more than sheer willpower. However, this came at a cost to some aspects of and these integrity. The escalator, for instance, only connects the three, the first three floors. Most of the underground floors have also gone unused in the ensuing years. Such quirks are a direct result of the circumstances surrounding the building's inception. Yashiga told me that he and his son have been to a world's fair once. He said that the line to see the moon was was really long. So long that it made them tired. But he said his son still had a good time. People also call Yoshido Chief Mishishuma. His full name is Yoshiro Mizushima. People also call Yoshiro Chief Mizushima. His full name is Yoshiro Mizushima. Yoshiro is big. Yoshiro is a big important man in the computer room. So he doesn't get to go out with his son much. He's glad that he got to see the world's fair. 
Now I wish I could have seen the world's fair with Kijito too. Then he and I are always bad. But he and I are always together in the computer room. So that's okay. I'm content. Knock it on Broadway Construction Part 4 In most cases, large commercial buildings are run by their owners. They control everything from PR to tenants and internal bylaws. PW was an exception to that rule. From the very start, shop and visitors show Shop and residential spaces alike were sold piecemeal. People who bought their real estate inside the building were then free to utilize it however they pleased. Because of this, soon after MB opened, shop owners and residents start started remodeling work on their respective stores and apartments. In the end, this me meant that formal blueprints for MV weren't drafted until eight years after the building was originally completed. Even in those early days, the building's layout had already become too unwieldy for anyone to fully grasp at that stage. Yashiro always had me sitting on his lap. I didn't hit my head. Oh, nice and gentle. I love Yoshido. Yoshido always calls me Miko. Miko is a girl's name. But Yoshido gave it to me. So I love it. Nakano Broadway Construction Part 5 The basement of Broadway once housed a vacuum tube uh, computer with in its walls. It had been brought into the building after the end of World War II by war criminals who evaded arrest, shielded from the prying eyes of MacArthur's GHQ. The vacuum tube computer's purpose in those days remains a mystery. It's possible it could have been utilized for things such as mathematical computations or code breaking. But such speculation is unconfirmed. As time went on, there was eventually nobody left to carry on the original, uh, the, on the originally purpose set forth for the terminal. At that point, the computer was apparently buried inside a wall somewhere. Dark here. No I'm dark. I can't see a thing. I'm okay being in the dark. I'm not scared of this or anything. But it's never been this dark before. No shit it's not here. I don't even smell him. Let's just go back outside. Yoshiro, where are you? Yashiro. Yashiro. Please, sit me on your lap. Can you pet my head again? Yashiro. Oh, dear. Now you know. Now you know who I really am. Um, um. Who am I? Somebody, anybody, some. Yeah, that's right. My name is Miko. 
Yashiro is my friend. Pete is your friend. Yashiro is calling out for me. He's been looking for me this whole time. He found me. Yashiro. Please leave us be. Don't go looking for us. <laughs> 